Good day everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel, our lesson for today is all about, safety and precautionary measures in dealing with different types of weather. Learning objectives, discuss the public storm warning system. List down safety and precautionary, measures when dealing with the each of the weather. Pagasa or Philippine Atmospheric, Geophysical, and Astronomical Services Administrations warns us of any approaching weather disturbances by using the following storm signals. Tropical Cyclone Wind Signal Hashtag 1 winds at 30 hanggang 60 km per hour is expected. Intermittent rain may be expected in at least 36 hours. People are advised to listen to the latest severe weather. Bulletin issued by Pagasa every 6 hours, Tropical Cyclone Wind Signal Hashtag Dalawa. Winds of greater than 61 km per hour and up to 120 kulf. Is expected in at least 24 hours. People who are traveling by air and sea are caution. Outdoor activities of children should be postponed. Tropical Cyclone Wind Signal Hashtag Tatlo Winds of greater than 121 kph and up to Isandaan at pitumpung kulf is expected in at least 18 hours. Traveling is very risky especially by air or sea. People are advised to seek shelter in strong building. Evacuate low-lying areas and stay away from the coast and riverbanks. Classes in all levels should suspended and children should stay in the safety of strong buildings. Tropical Cyclone Wind Signal Hashtag Apat Winds of greater than 171 km per hour and up to 200 at 20 kulf is expected in at least 12 hours as the eye of the typhoon approaches the weather will worsen continuously it is potentially very destructive to the community all travels and outdoor activities should be cancelled evacuation to safer shelters should have been completed Tropical cyclone wind signal hashtag limang intense winds of more than 220 kph may be expected in at least 12 hours, the situation is potentially extremely destructive or catastrophic to the community all travels and outdoor activities should be cancelled. Evacuation to safer shelters should have been completed. Example of this is the Typhoon Yolanda which happened on 2013. Typhoon Yolanda or Typhoon Haiyan. Pagasa also releases color-coded rainfall warnings. Clothing. During fine or warm days, people wear thin clothes and shorts. During rainy or cold days, we wear thick clothes such as sweaters or jackets. Did you understand the lesson? Thank you for watching in this video. I hope you learned something in this video. Feel free to like, share and subscribe for more educational content.